Hello engineers, welcome back to Engineering Design Simplified. In this video series, I will be solving tough engineering mechanics problems. If you want to watch more videos like this, please subscribe to my channel and press that bell button so that you will be notified when I upload a new video. Today's problem is determine the general expression for the moments of F about point B and about point O. Evaluate your expressions for F equal to 750 Newtons, R equal to 2.4 meters and theta equal to 30 degrees and phi equal to 15 degrees. In this problem given is a bar O, B, A like shown in figure the shape of the bar and the radius here is R and this distance B to O is 2 times R. There is a force F is applied at an angle phi from this line. So this line is perpendicular to this line. So angle between this perpendicular line and this line is theta. So in this problem we need to derive an expression uh, for moment about B due to F and moment about O due to F and also for this given values uh, we need to evaluate those equations. Let us see in the coming slides how to solve this problem. So uh, the force F is applied here at an angle phi from this line. So angle between this line and this line, this line is 90 degrees and this angle is theta. So the horizontal component of F can be written as Fx and its vertical component is Fy. So since this angle is phi and this angle is theta, then angle between this Fx and this line will be theta. So the angle between Fx and F will be theta minus phi. So Fx can be written as Fx equal to F cos theta minus phi. Similarly, Fy can be written as Fy equal to F sin theta minus phi. So since this angle is theta here and this radius is r, then this distance from this point to this point b can be written as r cos theta. So this is r, uh, this is r and this is theta. So distance from here to here will be r cos theta. Similarly, the distance from here to here can be written as uh, from here to here it is r radius and here from here to here it is r sin theta. So that is written here r plus r sin theta. Now moment due to f about point b can be written as fx into this distance plus fy into this distance. So that is written here mb equal to fx r cos theta plus fy r plus r sin theta. So let us substitute fx and fy we will get equation like this. Like this. So these two can be multiplied and then finally this equation mb will become fr into cos theta minus phi into cos theta plus sin theta minus phi plus sin theta minus phi uh, into sin theta. So the last term and first term can be simplified as uh, cos theta minus phi minus theta. So from this uh, after simplification we get mb moment about b due to f can be written as mb equal to f into r into cos phi plus sin theta minus phi. So this is the expression to find moment about B due to F. Now let us derive equation to find moment about O due to F. So here the moment about O due to F can be written as Fx into R cos theta plus 2R this distance plus Fy into this distance r plus r sin theta. So that is written here mo equal to fx 2r plus r cos theta plus fy r into 1 plus sin theta. So r into 1 plus sin theta is r plus r sin theta. So after simplification, uh, after substituting this value, this fx and fy and simplification, we get mo equal to fr into 2 cos theta minus phi plus sin theta minus phi plus cos phi. So this is the equation to find moment about O due to F. So you can see that from the last equation and this equation the difference is 2R cos theta minus phi. Now let us apply this F equal to 750 Newtons, R equal to 2.4 meters, theta is 30 degrees and phi is 15 degrees. So moment uh, due to F about B can be uh, after substituting these values and simplification, we get mb equal to 2205 Newton meter, 2205 Newton meters. So similarly, uh, 
uh, by substituting these values into this equation and simplification we get moment due to f about o is 5682 newton meters that's all for today's video if you like this content please like share and subscribe thanks for watching